to transfer uh, a VHS recording to uh, a DVD um, you need a video capture card and Pinnacle Studio 14 software which comes with the Dazzle that I purchased so um, step one of course is to capture the recording and step two is to write it to the disc and that's what uh, this video will deal with so to begin um, open up Pinnacle Studio 14 when the software uh, opens up you go to the top left hand corner to import click on it make sure in the top left hand corner of the new window you select uh, the video um, capture card this one is dazzle sorry for the background noise uh, the DV, uh, the uh, VHS player is already playing in the background and that's what you can see uh, in the middle screen there's a, uh, a record um, selling company running a, a commercial on right now now in the middle of the screen here uh, there's a speaker icon take that volume increase it to the maximum and uh, you can just start the capture by clicking the uh, bottom right hand corner of the uh, special window we are now recording and uh, it's important again that you um, have the uh, capturing the sound if you are you'll get a bouncing video there shown here in green so we're going to hit uh, stop the capture now and um, with that we'll just close out uh, this uh, import uh, window by clicking the X and automatically uh, the TV commercial um, comes on there we're going to take that and drag it down into the uh, timeline and uh, there it is so um, next we're going to go uh, make movie the uh, we got to click on the uh, top left hand corner there's three things so, uh, uh, sorry phase one is import um, which we already did uh, phase two is um, a section where you can actually edit the video clip uh, by cropping it down and so on and step three is make movie we'll click on that right now let's look at the top left hand corner there's uh, you can make a, a disc or you can make a file or you can make a tape or you can uh, post it to the web uh, of those four icons in the top left hand corner we want to click on the this thing it's already selected there are uh, different um, settings you can go click on to but we're just going to make it easy to the default one uh, right here uh, top left hand corner again um, a little bit off to the right uh, we're going to click uh, click on create disk so we're going to uh, click on create disk so a new window pops up and it wants to know uh, where to put the image file uh, into a folder uh, we're just going to select OK and go with the default so what is happening now is the file is actually rendering um, because it's DVD writer it's going to take a uh, several minutes um, I'll come back uh, as soon as it's done and uh, when it's finally finished writing it uh, opens a disk for you um, my pinnacle software makes a sound um, that the files finished even though it's obvious that the disk opened so when I take the disk I turn it over and I can see the uh, difference in the um, coloring of the bottom of the disk where it's actually written onto so and that'll work